Hey there, everyone. I'm News 6 meteorologist Samara Kukinas. Thanks for joining us here on ClickOrlando.com. Tropical depression, Claudette, continues to move to the northeast, bringing quite a bit of rain to Alabama as well as Georgia and eventually into the Carolinas, where we could see... Uh, Claudette go back up to tropical storm status by Sunday night going into Monday. We'll keep you, of course, up to date with those changes as they happen. Tonight, though, in central Florida, really not a whole lot of rain, but we can't rule out a few passing showers, especially as you get closer to about 7 or 8 o'clock tonight. A few little rain showers could pass through the metro and maybe over Marion County, but really not a whole lot of rain to speak of. Tomorrow morning, I think a lot of the rain, when it happens, if it happens at this point, will stay north of the metro. And then by about 2 or 3 o'clock, they'll start to move into southern zones as well as around I-95 and I-4 and areas to the east. So we're not talking about a widespread rain event, but rain coverage is going to be up slightly tomorrow to about 50% late in the day. 75 will be your overnight low under mainly cloudy skies. Then for Father's Day tomorrow, check this out, your high of 92 is going to feel like 101 because of all that humid air, your rain chances increasing later in the day. Let's get some results and show you your pinpoint accurate seven day forecast as we head into Monday, which is actually the first full day of summer. It starts at 1131 Sunday night. So first full day of summer, 60% coverage of rain. We remain with that unsettled weather pattern for most of the upcoming week. Your high temperatures in the low 90s, overnight lows mid 70s. That's your pinpoint accurate forecast. Thanks for logging on. You're now up to date.